Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh, and I thought I would review the market. Uh, the reason I wanted to go over the SPY today is because we had a big drop, actually. This was Friday, and interestingly enough, I didn't look at the market really all of last week. I took some time off, and someone had mentioned to me, oh, there was a, over the weekend, Melissa, the market had a, you know, 2% correction or a huge correction, and I, and I didn't even look at it until yesterday. So last night I looked at the market, then I saw what we did Friday, and then I saw what we did Monday yesterday, and now of course here we are today. So we're actually gapping down today. We closed yesterday at 216.34, and this morning we're down, we're down more than a buck right now. I mean the market, we don't open until 9.30, but you know we are gonna probably gap down and hold the gap down today wherever we open. But the interesting thing is after this, seeing this, when I saw this last night, Irregardless of the gap down today, this is an extremely bullish uh, move that the market has made here on Monday. So it, I didn't see this, okay? It doesn't even matter. I looked at the market here last night, and I'm also reading the gap today. So you take into account all of the gaps. Bottom line is that, you know, it's good sometimes to take a couple of days off or a week off or more from looking at charts. Everybody needs a holiday and everybody needs a break. And it's good to step away sometimes. And you can see things much clearer sometimes when you just step away. But I will tell you that I've been calling the market higher all along. We could have done it here as a breakout. We didn't. It was over the holiday period. People were off right before Labor Day and after Labor Day. So this is what we were talking about several weeks ago where the market did like a fake out. So Friday it did like a fake out. Gap down fell hard. Then gapped down actually Monday morning, but reversed, okay? So it was a very bullish move that the market had yesterday. Very, very bullish. We will hold, we will hold, we will continue higher, we will make another brand new all-time high and reach over that 220 number yet this year in 2016. I don't know when we do it, but I know that we will. And so we had this discussion about fake outs. That's all that that move was Friday. And people really probably still believe especially with the gap down today, that the market's gonna break and then it's lower and that we could fall all the way down into here or here. I don't think that happens. If we do, we'll still be bullish, but I don't, I don't think that happens. I just don't think that happens. So this was a huge sign of bullishness that happened in the market yesterday and goes again to the point I was trying to teach and make about fake outs. You look at the information, you read the information, you read the power of money, you read the institutional money, you rate the gap. You could have rated the gap down yesterday. You could rate the gap down today. You could have rated the gap down on Friday, okay? So very important to have a system that you can rely on, which I do, which is the 26 points. It tells you, is this really going to break? Is this for real? So you don't get faked out in either direction, okay? Long or shorts, all right? But I will tell you when I looked at this, just I didn't even study it, I didn't even do a video, I did nothing, I just looked at it really quickly last night, I looked at the chart of the market, before the gap down this morning, I said, woo, this is really, 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 for the market to have gapped down the way it did after the sell up on Friday, yesterday, and retrace like this, and get bought in the way that it was yesterday, was so bullish, so bullish. So really we're higher. I mean, money is stepping in at every turn that it needs to. Every time, every turn, every chance, every chance it gets. And I'm telling you that's something that I teach in my class, something you can learn from me by being in the room with me as well. So the market's higher, don't be faked out. This is Melissa with the stockswoosh.com. I have a class this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. If you wanna make money with me before the end of the year, you gotta do the class this weekend and start trading with me fall. You wanna learn it this weekend and get in the groove and start doing it and start making money. Email me at melissathestockswish.com for more information on my Golden Gap course, which is this Saturday and Sunday, September 17th and 18th. Thanks everybody, have a great day.